Hello friends welcome to our YouTube channel. In this video we are going to discuss about recently published Global Environmental Performance Index released by World Economic Forum. India has finished at the bottom of the Environment Performance Index 2022 released by the World Bank. This means India is among those countries in the world that have the worst environmental health. Out of 180 countries that have been ranked, India is in the bottom 5 with a score of 18.9. Even Bangladesh, Myanmar, Pakistan, and Vietnam have ranked better than India. The country has also scored poorly on various measures such as control of corruption, rule of law, and government effectiveness. The deterioration is huge as in the Environmental Performance Index 2020, India was ranked 168th out of 180 countries. The score of 27.6. Denmark was ranked first in the sustainability and environmental health categories this time. The Environmental Performance Index was first established in 2002 as an index that measures the environmental sustainability of various countries. It was established as a global parameter in association with the World Economic Forum and Columbia University. The report suggests that the economic prosperity of a country makes investing in policies on the environment possible leading to desirable income. The report further states that building necessary infrastructure can at large provide other environmental benefits like clean drinking water and sanitation, reduce ambient air pollution, and control hazardous waste. The report also states that countries that have been able to reduce their greenhouse gas emissions have made the greatest gains in curbing climate change. It also noted that these efforts have positive effects on human health and ecosystems. India, with remarkably poor air quality and quickly rising greenhouse gas emissions, comes in at the very bottom of the country rankings for the first time. The low scores of India and other countries in the Environmental Performance Index suggest that they need to step up their efforts on various sustainability measures such as climate change and air and water quality. Some of the other countries that have been identified as laggards include Afghanistan and Nepal. Their low scores can be attributed to weak governance. Vietnam, 178 rank, Bangladesh, 177. Pakistan, 176, and India, 180, have been ranked the lowest based on their prioritizing economic growth over environmental sustainability. Countries such as Myanmar, 179, and Haiti, 173, which are facing civil unrest, have also ranked low in the chart. The neighboring China which also faces issues related to poor air quality and growing greenhouse gas emissions, continue to impact China's Environmental Performance Index ranking, placing the nation 160th out of 180 countries on the 2022 scorecard. Greenhouse gases continue to rise in China, ranked 160, India, Russia, ranked 112, and several other major developing countries. Despite the international commitment to reduce the emission, Denmark has earned the number one ranking, while the world's biggest economy, the United States, ranks low, 43, among wealthy democracies. Denmark is followed by the UK, Finland, Malta, and Sweden. The index shows global progress to reduce greenhouse gas emissions remains insufficient to meet the net zero greenhouse gases by 2050, a target set in the 2021 Glasgow Climate Pact. Using the past 10 years emissions trajectory as a basis for projecting 2050 emissions, the Environmental Performance Index researchers forecast that the vast majority of countries will not achieve the net zero goal. Denmark has set a national target of reducing 2030 emissions by 70% compared to the 1990 level and has adopted a comprehensive policy agenda to deliver on this commitment, including recently expanded greenhouse gases taxes. More than 50% of emissions in 2050 are slated to come from just four countries, China, India, 
the United States, and Russia. If you like this video please like, share and subscribe our channel.